Before we get into today's video, I want to thank our patrons on Patreon. Thank you to Linda and Sophia. Uh, if you would like to be a patron on Patreon as well, you can hit up the link down below. Uh, the money goes towards the Christo Pagan Church that we are starting here on YouTube. If you would like to support this channel in other ways, uh, you can do so by hitting up the eBay link down below. That is my business. It keeps lights on, keeps uh, the channel up and, and running, keeps food in my stomach and all that good stuff. Uh, if you do not have the funds to support this channel, but you would like to do so, you can hit up the subscribe button right down there. You can hit up the bell notification also right there. Uh, you can hit that like or dislike button. It all appeases the algorithmic gods of YouTube. All hail the algorithmic gods of YouTube. And if you've done all that, and if it is safe for you to do so, you can uh, consider sharing this on your social media platforms. Now, to today's video. Hello, girls, guys, or otherwise. This is Rich with your Table Talk Thursday. Uh, as per usual, we have our Table Topics Cube. There will be a link down below if you would like to get a Table Topics Cube similar to this. Uh, I have pulled the remaining questions for the year of 2022. I, this is currently quarter to three on Sunday, the 28th of August. Uh, yeah, I, I'm going to try to go through these and do a mass uh, video uh, recording so I can get all these done and edited and uploaded and ready for uh, release so I don't have to worry about them whenever I get back to New Jersey. We're going to see how many videos I can I can do. I have my coffee here and we're just going to get right on into it. Let me go ahead and grab, I have not looked at these, I only counted out how many time, how many more videos that I would have for the remainder of the year and pulled those out. But let's go ahead and get on into it. Today's topic is, is it a choice or an obligation to help someone in need? I would say that it, it is an obligation. And it, it hmm, see, the, the way that I see it is if you are able, if it is within your means to help somebody in need, um, and whenever I say in need, I mean like a an actual emergency. Um, you know, if you have the capability of helping or assisting a, a person that is having a medical type of emergency, if you are at a, all able to help, even if it's just calling 911 um, or, you know, sounding an alarm saying, hey, that, you know, this person is, you know, in their life is in jeopardy, I think you kind of have the obligation. As long as if your life is not put at immediate risk. And, you know, we, we see that more and more uh, today with regards to things like um, mass shoot shootings. Yeah, let, let, let's just go ahead and call it out on the carpet. We have an epidemic of, uh, of said uh, occurrences. I, I want to be choosing about my words for the YouTube algorithms, but we do have an epidemic in this country with regards to uh, that type of situation, that type of occurrence. And in that instance, uh, I... I think you have a choice. I mean, you, you always have a choice um, to do it. Um, but I, I think for me, it would be more of an obligation of making sure that everybody is safe uh, or everybody is taken care of in, in a any circumstance. Uh, whenever it comes to mass shooting, it, I very much would call upon the, you know, you must secure your own uh, oxygen before supplying the oxygen to others around you. So in that instance, make sure that you are safe, make sure that you are um, well protected and uh, you know you are not in immediate danger before you go helping somebody else. And in, in that instance, it is definitely a choice. And in all instances, I, I do want to say you do have a choice. Um, but morally speaking, 
I would say that I would say, I, I would say that I would say, um, I, I would like to say that you would have more of an obligation to assist somebody that is in immediate help or immediate danger um, what, with regards to their medical uh, situations. So to me, that would be more of an obligation rather than a choice, um, though your choice of having this obligation is also a choice that you have. So in, in essence, I guess my, I, I kind of talk myself out of the whole obligation part. Uh, everything is definitely a choice, even your choice to, for it to be an obligation. Now, there is a uh, law out there, at least in the United States, called the Good Samaritan Law, that if you were to uh, help, and, and I, I, I could be uh, incorrect on this, um, but it, it's something that they tell us whenever we do CPR class, and that you are covered by the Good Samaritan Law, that if you attempt to help somebody and they still end up dying, that you cannot be prosecuted for that. Um, and I'm pretty sure that I got all, all that correct. A any lawyers out there, please, uh, or anybody that knows uh, this law better than I do, please um, do reach out and let me know. But, you know, whenever you are helping somebody and they, you know, they end up not making it, uh, yeah, you, you are protected that you are not going to be prosecuted for your... Uh, your attempts to help save a life. Now, whenever it comes to, say, like financial needs or, you know, uh, something of, of that nature, again, uh, it comes down to you have the choice of giving of your own finances if, if you can do so. And in... in my instance, I, I would say that if you provide a, you know, well-rounded budget and you can prove to me that you can, you know, pay me back and all, all X, Y, and Z, all that stuff, that then I, I can, I, I can front you some money for whatever it is, X, Y, Z, whatever. So to me, it, it would be an obligation with conditions so yeah I, I would still say it's a choice um i i am very you know you you having a choice in the matter and i i, I hate to say that somebody is obligated just because they're in the presence of something or because they know somebody that you know has some need that you are obligated to give to them uh, whether it be of your your skills, your time, your your money, your efforts, um, what have you. So I I mean I'm a little a little wishy washy on this. For me, I, I would choose to be obligated to that, um, but I, I don't think this should be a blanket statement of you have the obligation. So yeah, <laughs> little little wishy washy. What what would be your uh, your take on this. Is it a choice or an obligation to help someone in need? Let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, may you have love, hugs, and ladybugs. Bye.